Hey everyone, Flanker Jack here. Just uh, bloody finally waking up on a Sunday morning here. Had a super busy, super, super busy late night at work. And obviously the time change today didn't happen. Um, just testing out some, just a lapel mic. I've never really used one of these before, so I hope it's working. Uh, have some things this week uh, to, that I want to use and videotape, so hopefully this works. But anyway, just want to get going. I'm going to try to lower the air a little bit. But hope everyone's doing okay. And the golf game is progressing. The weather's quite nice, so I am trying to make myself get outside and hit a few balls. But I don't seem to do well on Sundays just because I'm super stiff. And, uh, you know, coming, coming off of my four-day work week and late nights and won't lie to you, a few beers last night. But other than that, I'm really just trying to make sure that the equipment works. I'm going to go to the range here. Um, did get the new 101 tees, which I've had for about three weeks now. And I played a couple of rounds with them. Sorry, pardon me. Allergies. Um, absolutely wonderful, these clubs. I feel very confident with them. The issues I have in my game are really just me having to practice a bit on a certain, on a few things. I had a great range session um, on Wednesday, where Wednesday, Tuesday, where I had a few drills that I I found um, that really changed my my thought process in the swing and fixed i think i think it fixed at least one of the problems that i've been having as far as distance and accuracy so i'm going to work on those again today i think i'm just going to spend every range session from here on out working on a few things and then once they they work out that I can fix. I'm actually, I'm going to have a lesson tomorrow. Finally, actually have a live lesson from one of the pros at the golf course. I'm playing at Rhodes Ranch there. Um, scores, I'm still in the low 90s, but I'm not, I'm not scoring low because of poorly, like, poor shots. And what I mean by that is, you know, my driver is still very underpowered. I think this drill, these drills that I was I was doing the other day, I only hit three wood. That was the maximum club I hit last on Tuesday, and that three wood was flying. And I've never hit the three wood that far. So I'm going to try it today with the driver. The only issue I have is on Sundays, Rhodes Ranch lets you hit off the grass, and the grass practice area is pretty thrashed. Like it's it's pretty beat up. So I think that I want to get out there. I'm going to be testing this microphone. I hope it works. And I'm going to see how it does in the wind. If, if I'm having issues in the wind, you know, I'll just jump on Amazon real quick and buy a few uh, wind covers and things like that. But it's really, I, I don't even know the brand. It's just some cheap no-name brand off of Amazon. It was $20. So we'll see how it holds up. And I'll try to put some commentary in, though I, I'm very hesitant to do that when there's a lot of other people around. I tend to get strange looks. Not that I'm talking to myself anyway. So, we'll just cut. But the 101 T's, back to those. Um, absolutely wonderful. I do, I feel very, very good. The, the, the issue I had, and, I, and I'll blame a few, you know, I, I'll blame a few YouTube videos for, for what they were, what they've been teaching and the ones I've been focusing on is I'm actually now having to club down a bit on shots because these clubs are, are very, very forgiving. They're very, very easy to hit. They're very, very easy to uh, play. And so, you know, my, so one of my favorite shots, which is a little nine iron bump and run, you know, 5, 10, 15 yards off the green. I could just one, two hop it on and get it right near the hole. That club now is too powerful. 
for that shot. And so I went down to my 52 degree wedge. That club was too powerful. So my chipping and putting was good, but my chipping was too, I, 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 I've got to now lessen how, how hard I'm trying to hit it. And that's a weird place for me to be in because I just don't understand how that works. So I'm, I'm having to wrap my head around some things. But either way, I had a great ball striking session on Tuesday. I really just, I hit 200 balls. I know that's a lot, but I was doing so well and I felt so good. I just wanted to keep it up. So I'm just going to run in the Rhodes Ranch right now. We're going to see how we do. I'll get the camera set up. I'll try and do some commentary about what we're doing. If it's not too much getting in the way of the other players, and we'll figure it out from there. All right. See you soon.